The White Stripes is one of the hottest bands in the world right now. Last night, they blew Auckland Club the Dogs bollocks apart with their blistering mix of punky blues and rock and roll. Only two in the band, brother and sister Meg and Jack White. When we play, I don't really care if you hate it, you know. If, it does, if it's not your cup of tea, then it's not your cup of tea. It's not going to break my heart. You know, if you don't want to buy the record, I don't, know, I don't care. In just a few months, they've gone from obscurity to international stardom, with Jack on guitar and vocals and Meg on drums. They've got a sound like a nuclear train smash. You know, it's nice to feel like you accomplished something. You know, you know, I mean, it's had a good feeling, and to have it written on paper so that, like, you know, your kids will see it in 20 years or something. You know. I mean, the dog's bollocks was jam-packed with people last night, with the overflow standing outside in the road just to hear the white stripes. If we could just get this on stage, everyone would love what you're doing. You know? I thought that was just a brilliant thing that our dad said, because uh, <laughs> it's, it's so sarcastic to a kid who doesn't really understand that sense of humor, what that means. You know, we would almost probably think that, oh, he's right, yeah, if we're on stage, maybe people wouldn't like this. You know? The White Stripes is one of the most sought after bands in the world. For many, the most exciting thing to happen since the Sex Pistols changed the face of music 25 years ago. Gig of the year, no argument. Dylan Tate, One News.